Hey guys, welcome back to One Piece episode 32. In the last episode, we were introduced to Arlong and Nami was being very confusing. It, it appears that she's been running with Arlong's crew, the Fishman. The Fish... the Fishman, okay. Uh, it appears that she's been running with Arlong's crew and that she and she actually did cross Luffy and the the rest of them. But I think there's something else a miss here. I think there's something deeper than this. Because Arlong seems very, for lack of a better word, racist towards humans. And as such, it doesn't seem like he would have a human on his crew. So I expect that, one, Nami is a lot more proficient than she kind of lets on. A lot more useful than she lets on. And also that she's probably, she probably is doing something behind the scenes, something sneaky sneaky. But there's only one way to find out and that is by cracking on with One Piece episode 32. Which Kokoyashi village are Long's female leader? Seek out! I was saving it for last. What's wrong with that? Okay, sorry. How about you eat this thing instead? I wouldn't feed that rotten slop to my dog! Shh! Why? <laughs> There's something down there. Yeah, and I can smell your cooking. It's big. <laughs> wow. What the hell is that? Like Seiko. See, it's a big cow! Aww. It's a cow! What's that? A hippo? Whatever it is, you can tell it's from the Grand Line! What is it doing all the way out here in the East Blue? Why is he staring at it? It's adorable! It's hungry. He wants the food! What? Quick, give it to him before he sinks the ship! Come, come! <laughs> <laughs> you ain't getting any of Luffy's food. Uh-uh. That <laughs> wasn't a good idea. Oh crap, you made it bad! You back for more! Dumbass! There's no <laughs> reason to punch this poor hungry hippo. Aww. She's probably just a baby and can't catch food for herself yet. Huh? That right? You're insane. Here no, you go. he Eat exists up. to feed Don't anyone who's hungry. That does look good. Oh, what's the sound? <laughs> what a douche! What the hell are you doing? Damn jerk! It was gonna eat me with the plate. What could I do? <laughs> Here it goes! Right, to stand back. This is my show. He's just looking for something new to cook. Oh, yeah, cool. oh. oh right in the neck. <laughs> yes, back to the food. That was refreshing. You guys are insane. Yeah, that's why Sanji fits in. Aww, someone's gonna fly kick that. Where am I? My house. Huh? Sleep well. Who are you? How come Usopp always gets the chicks? I grow tangerines here. Want one? That's right! You're the one that hit me on the head! I would like a tangerine. I'm the one who saved you. If you had actually gone through with attacking that fish man, you would have been killed for sure, stupid outsider. Stupid outsider. You'd figure a kid from here would already know better. What would make a child do something so reckless? That's a question I'd really like an answer for. Killed his dad. I know, but they killed my daddy. They took everything from me. Those fishmen destroyed our town, killed my friends. I had to make them pay for what they did, no matter what. Don't you get that? So I went to Arlong Park by myself. But this girl stopped me from going in. Stupid Nami. The stupid titty stick. She's like an evil witch. <laughs> I can't stand this. I have to avenge my father. I don't care if I die. Then die. 
truly prepared to die and go. But you had better understand, boy. I stopped you. And this witch you hate kept you from carrying out your revenge. So far, you've cheated death twice. It's true. Just finish your tea and go. Hey, you're being a little rough on him, don't you think? She's saving his life. I don't care who he is. If he wants to kill himself, then so be it. He doesn't have what it takes to suffer for revenge. What? It takes time. I suffer as well. Revenge is not an easy path for one to carve out. And to die just because you're too foolish for patience is nothing but a coward's plan. So a lot of good morals in this show. What do you want from me? I can't stand the way I feel, but but I don't know what else I can do. Need to train. Need Without to get stronger. She's alive. Then go back home. She's worried about you. Okay. <laughs> She's a good person. And she grows tangerines. And I like For tangerines. A kid with tattoos, you're actually really sweet. What do you mean tattoo? Yeah, I piss off. You told me why you decided to come here to our village. Oh, right. My name is Captain Usopp. I'm you know looking Captain. for a girl named Nami. Nami? Hmm? You know her? No way! She's a part of the Arlon crew! <laughs> it certainly looks that way. The other shoe drop. Everybody here knows that cow. Even the little boy. It gets better, though. That okay. cow is my sister. We grew up here. Well, technically, she's my adopted sister since we were both orphans. Huh. But a sister's a sister, you know what I mean? Okay. I don't believe it. <laughs> Nami's house? It's mine, too. We were raised together in this house. She's the closest thing to family I have left since our foster mother died. The three of us used to be so happy together in Kokoyashi Village. How'd the mother die? So, you're telling me that Nami betrayed her mother, her sister, and her whole village just to be a part of Arlong's group? Obviously not, Usopp. A real witch, huh? Damn! Nami is a total witch! She had us completely fooled the entire time! Nope, she's just getting revenge. Even after she risked her life to save my village. I don't understand. She seemed so happy with us. Yeah? She was happy? Huh. My sister. We came here to try to convince her to come back with us. But I guess now that's pointless. Stop being so dense, Usopp. I just remembered that a shipmate of mine was taken prisoner by the fishman before we got here. Oh, I'm in trouble. Oh, you... So do you care about Zoro now? I guess you finally get it. I just used you guys to get what I wanted. You were skilled enough to serve my needs. But boy, were you guys a bunch of suckers. <laughs> she had you guys completely fooled. It's no use. Yeah. She's cold blooded. She Got them filled. For money, so you really shouldn't feel too bad. <laughs> if I were you, I would just admit defeat and try to forget the day you met her. I don't need to. Because <laughs> I never saw anything in her to be trusted in the first place. If she turned out to be a serial killer, I wouldn't be surprised. Zoro has instantly just twigged. See ya, nerd! Hey, anybody know why that guy just jumped in the water? It looks to me like he was just trying to get away from Nami. I don't blame him. She can be really mean sometimes. Maybe he's trying to escape. Any of you people think of that? Leg tied up? I gotta say, that looked a lot more like a suicide attempt to me. I was gonna say. What an asshole. Now I don't get to kill him. <laughs> <laughs> what an asshole. Seriously, life is a precious thing. That idiot! But why would Zoro make Nami blow her cover to save him? They're back up. She saved him. What do you think you're doing? <coughs> no. What do you think you're doing? <coughs> you're really just a nice girl who can't watch one guy die. Why don't you quit pretending? Because she's obviously playing a long con. No, you bastard! Uh, try that again and 
I'll make sure you die. <laughs> really? That's a lot of bandages. You must have been hurt pretty bad. Actually, I forgot my shirt. Grab these to cover up so you wouldn't get distracted. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I love Zoe. Tell me, what should we do with this guy? Lock him up. I'll take care of him when I have the time. Arlong! Hey, Arlong! Yeah? Well, spit it out. What is it? Yes, sir. This guy didn't come here alone. There was another long-nosed, weird-looking guy with him, but he got away. What the hell, Usopp? Of course he did. You left me for dead and got spotted anyway? I think... I think he escaped into Kokoyashi Village. Kokoyashi, huh? That's perfect. Now I have two reasons to go. It's Ooh. time to go have some fun. Yeah, I don't know why Zoro would try and ruin that. How long is coming? He is? But why? We just paid him this month's tribute, didn't we? It's probably about my weapons cache they found. Everyone go home. Genzo. Oh, Genzo. Typical Genzo. You know, who's Genzo? So you're the fool thought he could hoard weapons on my island. That's me. Does have a cool hat. Is there a new law that forbids us from having hobbies now as well? <sighs> Next you'll be telling us that we can't read books or play with our children anymore. It would be weapons that I have forbidden. They make it difficult for me and my men to keep the peace. <laughs> That's him? Our lungs gigantic! He's not even human! The big lot. He's a fish man. He's a fish bag. I'm responsible for 20 towns and villages, including this one. And as your leader, I cannot tolerate even a little rebelliousness. Wiping out Gosa was just a small example of what can happen when you do not do as you are told. Tribute money must be paid no matter what. What? Tribute money? It's just what it sounds like. Money we pay him so we can stay alive. Adults and children, if there is even a single person who can't pay, then what happened to Gosa will happen to everyone in this village as well. Wow. Our town and the people in it will be wiped from existence. So even the kids have to pay. That's how Arlong rules. To them, we're nothing but a subspecies, so killing us has always been easy. You pathetic humans need to stop with all this thinking you're up to. It's your greatest weakness. I'm allowing you to contribute to greatness here. Soon, Fishmen will conquer the humans, and your tributes will be a small part of the beginning of the glorious Arlong Empire! You're right, Hunt. Arlong Empire? They're planning on hmm. taking over the entire East Blue! I doubt Luffy will be happy with that. Oh! You're gonna get shivved. Oh no, he's dead! Oh no! Oh wait, she just cut him loose. Get out of here quick. Arlong's gonna be back soon. <laughs> Queen of Sword! Genzo! <laughs> just wrecked his umbrella. As an example to any other would-be rebels in this town, I'm going to kill you right now, so they can see the fate that awaits them! Makes sense. No way! That guy is insane! What's with all the soul marks? I won't let him. Uh, hey, wait! Don't go out there! You have absolutely no right to do this, Arlong! Great. We've paid your tribute without fail for over eight years. Why would we rebel against it now? Just think about it! It makes no sense! Now take your hands off Genzo! Yeah, it's not like he used the weapons. That's right. Let him go. Yeah, let Genzo go. Looks like you're rebelling now. He was planning a rebellion against me. But on the other hand, I could destroy you all. Please try to protect your friends so you won't give me an excuse to do that. Either way is fine, but rebellions will not be tolerated. Uh, everybody just go home. Do you want to waste all of our work over the past eight years? For what? The time for you to give your lives for this village was back when they first came. Now we must continue to be patient. The most important thing is that we continue to live. We swore we would not let them defeat us as long as we're alive. Well said. I agree with you. Yeah. It's good to know that even disgusting insects like you <gasps> enjoy being alive! Uh. 
There is no way any of you will ever come close to the perfection of the Fishman! I hate this guy. Damn you! Don't move! He wants you to attack. We can't just stand here! Your deaths will mean nothing. You must continue to be patient, even if I die. That's a good ending for you. Pay close attention, humans! <sighs> this is what happens to those who defy me, even if it's just inside their tiny heads! Oh no. Stop! Yes! Usopp, I love you! What was that? Up there! Look! There's someone on the roof! Who the hell is that guy? I am the great warrior of the sea! Captain! Usopp! You know, it's moments like that. Also known as the Demon King Usopp, feared and hated by almost half the world! I command thousands of men! Loyal and vicious men! That's the guy I told you about! The one with the long nose that got away! <laughs> Bring long on nose and fast legs. Men. I'll crush them one by one! <laughs> Doesn't need thousands. He started nothing and now he's pissed! What can a creature like you do to me? Can really annoy you. <laughs> That's the house he just picked up. Arlong, hold on just a second! After losing Goso, we can't afford to kill off any more tribute money! Villages are fun to destroy, but ruling over them makes us more money! Oh. If we lose them, we can always get more! This man must reign to me! destroying it all! Feel sorry for whoever's house that was. Am I dead yet? No, you're alright. Catch him and tear him apart! Let's go back to Arlo Court before he destroys everything! Yeah, I'm with you! Don't let him get away! Who does that jump sucker think he is? We'll be back. You can all live for now. This all just saved that guy's life at the cost of one house. It's not bad. This has all been my fault. What are you talking about? You're not a fish man, are you? Yeah, but who was that guy who attacked? <laughs> Hello, Long everyone. nose and fast legs. It's good to be back home. Nami? It's Nami. You. <laughs> you got a bit of a reputation. What's wrong? You never just come walking through Kokuyashi anymore. I heard quite a commotion. Arlong, huh? It's a strange hat you've got there, sir. I only Aww. have to get seven million more berries. Your already bad reputation just keeps getting worse. That's fine. I am a pirate. Arlong can be a very reasonable guy when he wants to. I just need a little more money to finish our agreement. Just seven million berries shy of the 100 million gold. So that's why she's so obsessed with treasure. <laughs> it's gonna buy back our village. I can't believe it. She tells me to run, but I've got nowhere else to go but here. <laughs> Besides, I promised Luffy I'd bring her back with me. Oh my god. What's he up to? These things are getting messy around here. And this is why we stand Zoro. Yeah! <laughs> oh my god. There's no way you just wrangled the freaking sea cow. This show is too good. I just want to sit and watch it like all night. Jesus. Oh my God, it's so good. So we did find out exactly what. So it wasn't a long con um, is what, what I basically thought she joined the, the crew for. But she's trying to buy back her, her village, which I think both you and I know that that probably isn't going to happen when she reaches the 100 million berries. Arlong's just not going to care. And I reckon that... I think that that's where this is going to go. She's going to get the 100 million berries and Arlong's going to be like, Nah, there's no way that I'm giving you your village. And... Nami's going to go absolutely nuts. That is what I think. That's what I'm calling just now. I like to make these little predictions because then we get to see if I'm right or if I'm on a completely wrong tangent. But I knew that Nami wasn't evil, you see. She's lovely. Yeah.
But, unfortunately, guys, that's all we've got time for in this episode. So, as always, thanks a lot for watching. I've been Steejo. You've been awesome. And I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.